Fish Chan's a bit, well, until the recent thing. He was a bit dead, wasn't he? He just didn't really do anything. He was just sort of being himself and being a strange, but didn't really do anything funny. Yeah, the, the, there's a thing I like to, uh, I called in my documentary, like, uh, the dark ages of Chris Chan, because he just, there's nothing happening. He just ruins his life, pretty much, and there's nothing funny. Yeah. Uh, it only it only started becoming like funny again, before you know <laughs> everything came out, uh, which is a shame. Yeah, is this is like this this Chris Chan development has like put the whole the whole Lolco thing into just I think way more people know about it now just because of that. Yeah, I also don't know how to feel about Lolcows anymore because it's like. I remember thinking with Chris Chan, yeah, he's, not, he's obviously not going to do anything bad. He may have like sprayed some pepper sprayed someone, but that's the worst he's going to do. Uh, and now, when I think of like other low cows like uh, King Cobra JFS, I'm like, surely he can't do anything, right? Mm. It, well, King Cobra JFS probably is. He's probably all right. I, I feel like he he might minorly fuck up his own life, but I don't think he's going to do anything like Chris did. At least I hope not. Yeah, I definitely hope not. Uh, it's very morbid, but how I hope uh, Cobes's tail ends is just him withering away by himself, uh, not really harming anyone, just kind of succumbing to his own actions. He's on the way to doing that. He's on the way absolutely, to doing that. Absolutely, absolutely. He is just one of the worst looking people in the the world because of how he's treated himself like everyone compares him to the the corpse of gg allen i believe that's his name he's having he... a shocker with his ear isn't he he's having an absolute shocker <laughs> it's, it's just it's just dead it's gone once you get to that stage you just gotta shave it all off haven't you you gotta you just gotta be done with it i mean just everything he needs he just needs to like be put in an empty room and uh, he just sit there, let him let himself recover to the best of his ability, because he's probably destroyed. Ugh, Eric, he's probably destroyed his body so much where he, he can only recover like twenty five percent. I don't know how. I'm not a I'm not a doctor, but he's. But he bikes though. He rides bike. Uh, yeah, I ride bike. He rides bike. But he doesn't. We don't know how much he goes outside anymore, because he doesn't really have any need to. He's been. Banned from all the local bars. Um, friends, I don't think he really has any other than those in his apartment. A floor lord's been banished. Scotty d seems to dislike him. Scrapper Steve is Scrapper Steve. Uh, and I can't really... Oh, Darth. Darth seems to have just vanished. I've not heard from Darth in a while. I'm not even like I. I don't even. I gotta be honest. I don't even know the people in the in the Cobra thing. I've got very minimal experience with Cobra. I only I only heard about him through the Null stream. To be honest, that's the first I ever heard of it. Ah. <clears throat> well, uh, his plug. I I have a documentary on him. <laughs> I've seen that. I have oh, okay. seen that. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I don't really like Darth, but out of the um just goblins he hangs out with or has hung, hung out with Darth's all he's pretty much got so that's relatively normal and he's or an actual Darth, dwarf like a, or Darth like whatever his name is it's just it's, it's Darth Flinny B but Darth Darth for short and what does he do what is, what's his what's his interactions with Cobra then uh, he pretty much just sits and drinks with them but I mean I think occasionally they go shooting I don't know when the last time they did that was or if they do them both together. Yeah, no, that would be a, a bad idea. That would they, probably be the end. Of the they King may Cobra have done it. <laughs> that would probably be the end of the King Cobra JFF story. But, uh... He'd be dead. Yeah. I mean, as long as it's just aimed at himself. <laughs> Very morbidly, I know. Uh, it's probably the best way it can go. That's the best way for, for them to sort of end up, though, isn't it? Where they just sort of... You just sort of ruin yourself. Yeah, just anything. go out, go out on your own terms. Don't just let yourself wither away. Because if... if there's some that are just they they completely pollute everybody in their life. 
those are the ones that are the dangerous ones. Yeah, I, I feel really bad for Clint. Clint just has to deal with this, and he, he probably has kind of given up. I don't know if he still buys him uh, stuff anymore, like food. I think Cobra just orders everything now. Because he's just that much of a drain, just emotionally, uh, monetarily. Not really much point. 